Okay, let's check out another way of using text in SketchUp. You find it where the rectangle is and you find it where this letter is, the 3D text. So if you open this, then this window will pop up. You can enter your text here. And the first thing that we're going to write is a pyramid because we are going to build a pyramid. You can choose the font and the height and we are going to have it extruded now. 152 millimeters and okay. And then you see you get this extruded writing here, this extruded text. And we are going to do this once more and we're going to write prism now. And you can experiment with the fonts. I'm going to choose the Open Sans font now and put my prism here. And once again, I'm writing prism, but it's a prism with five sides. And now I'm leaving the extrusion, but the text is still going to be filled. I'm choosing this Oswald font here. And you see now that it's a flat font. So it's a 2D object and it's still filled. You see the gray area, so the font is filled. Once again, another object that we're going to build is the sphere. No, sphere. And I'm choosing another font and putting my sphere here. And last but not least, once again, 3D text to create a segment. I just I just call it segment and this this we have this handwriting font here and not extruded and not filled and let's put it here and you see now there's no filling on the text and this text is very interesting it looks cool so you have an object you can double click on it and you can edit the object because it's a group so i could for example extrude now one letter into infinity and you can move it around just like any other object. So you could click on it and move it or turn it, rotate it, stretch it, whatever. And we remember we also have the 2D text here where you find the tape measure. You have the 2D text. And the difference between those different texts is that you can always edit the 2D text. So for example, I could write 2D text in here now and I click, but I can still edit it. And this wouldn't be possible with the 3D text. And also the 2D text is always readable. No matter how you position yourself, you can always read the 2D text. But sometimes the 3D text is cool because it looks like a real object.